Today is Tuesday. It's May 30th, 2017, and this is Wayne Goldsboro Television. I'm Wayne Alley. Well, I trust you had a safe and memorable Memorial Day weekend. Indeed. I noticed there were a lot of flags on veteran cemeteries around the Wayne County area. That's a wonderful thing. We should reflect and remember and honor those. Well, I'm glad you're with us today. We were not here yesterday, as you well know, but there were a lot of things happening over the weekend for Memorial Day. A lot of things happening at the, uh, for instance, at the uh, uh, Veterans Memorial across the street from the courthouse. They had a ceremony yesterday. Also, the, uh, don't forget the uh, Wings of Wayne taking place Saturday or over the weekend downtown Goldsboro. And uh, we'll have more on that later on. Let's see uh, about today being the, what is it? It is the 30th. You know, June is only, uh, what, a couple of days away? June 1st is Thursday? Whew, can you believe that? Uh, and a quick reminder, by the way, that on June 6th, that will be the date of the next Wayne County Commissioners. The Board of Commissioners will meet on June 6th that morning. On, uh, uh, that begins at 8 o'clock with a briefing, and then at 9 o'clock the formal meeting itself will begin. Now, let's see. Oh, and today, by the way, today the Board of Commissioners meet to continue their their budget hearings, their budget sessions for uh, the fiscal year 2017-18. That's coming up later on this morning. They'll meet, I believe it's at 9 o'clock, in the Board of Commissioners' room on the fourth floor of the Wayne County Courthouse. Okay, what's special about today? I'm glad you asked. Today is the 30th. Today is Mint Julep Day. There you go. You ever had a mint julep? Yeah, me either. Anyway, it's uh, also National Senior Health and Fitness Day. Actually, that's tomorrow, so that's about it. Today's Mint Julep Day, and that's it? Well, okay, we'll make it a special day anyway. Here's today's trivia question. Are you ready for this? On average, on average, you will find 61,000 Americans each hour at this location. 61,000 Americans, and that's kind of a broad statement, 61,000 Americans on average, 24 hours a day, 365 days a year, will be identified as being here. Where is here? 61,000 Americans at any given time, on average, each hour. Where, where are they? Okay, that's the here question for today. Where is here? <laughs> okay, all right, good. Uh, today, by the way, uh, rather coming up on June 8th, which is uh, not this week, but next week, that's a week from Thursday, it's gonna be a big blood drive at the Red Cross office at 600 North George Street. 600 North George Street. That's uh, June 8th from 10 till 2.30, all right? 10 till 2.30, 600 North George Street is where it will be held. And it, uh, it's uh, actually the Wayne County Employees Blood Drive, but if you're not a Wayne County employee, you can still give blood beginning at 10 o'clock. And it helps if you call and make an appointment to do that. That number 919-735-7201. All right, let's see what's going on weather-wise around the Wayne County area. As you can see, by the way, cut back to that. You can see outside here, we have cloudy skies. And once in a while, you see a hint of sunshine kind of bouncing around off those clouds. But it, uh, that's what we're going to have for most of the day today. We do have a chance of showers. Showers and thunderstorms possible up until about 9 o'clock. And then after that, between 9 and 3 this afternoon, we do have a chance of rain again. Uh, but then a chance of showers, maybe even a thunderstorm this afternoon after 3 o'clock. Today's high near 86 degrees, 86 the high. All right, so we got a ways to go yet. We're only at 69 right now across the area. Uh, later on, uh, we do have uh, winds becoming light up to about nine miles an hour later this morning. Chance of rain today is at 50%, 50%, which means it's either going to rain or it's not going to rain. In fact, last night, did you note the storm that rolled through south of us last night? You know, I did a lot of damage in Sampson County in the Clinton area. Is it Clinton or Clinton? Anyway, it did a lot of damage in Sampson County and moved on, on over into Duplin County. So most of it moved south of us. Some of us did get some rain, some didn't last night. Now tonight we do have a chance of showers, maybe a thunderstorm before midnight, uh, and then a slight chance of showers after that. Otherwise it'll be mostly cloudy and a low this evening near 68 degrees, which is about where we are right now. For tomorrow we see um, a chance of showers and thunderstorms after three o'clock, partly sunny otherwise. So we'll actually see a little bit of sunshine um, up until about 3, and then we have a chance of getting some rain. Uh, high tomorrow near 87 degrees, and we'll have a light breeze out of the southwest tomorrow, and tomorrow the chance of rain at 30 percent. 69 degrees, cloudy skies in Wayne County right now as we speak. 
you know, I wouldn't doubt that we actually would see a little bit of sunshine at some point today. Some point. It may not last long, but we may see it sometime today. All right. Father's Day is coming up on June 17th. Excuse me, June 18th. June 18th is Father's Day. And on the, seven, on the 16th, <laughs> I know, I have trouble with calendars. Calendars and clocks, my downfall. Anyway, coming up on June 16th is the big golf tournament at Goldsboro Municipal Golf Club. Uh, Goldsboro Municipal Golf Course. It's a four-man Super Bowl format, $55 per player. This is a, a golf tournament that will benefit Make a Difference Food Pantry. Make a Difference Food Pantry. That's Mackenzie Henson and her family, her mom, and all those volunteers that help out with that food pantry. Anyway, that's coming up on June 16th at Goldsboro Municipal. Then, the next day, there is a, the second annual Father's Day Grill Off. It'll be taking place at Waynesboro Park. Waynesboro Park, June 17th, starts at 8.30, goes to 4. And if you want uh, information about either of these activities, the golf tournament or the the Father's Day Grill Off on June 17th, call this number, 919-919-252-3700, 919-252-3700. Okay, I uh, got a note here from Jeff Sparrow out at the Wayne County Landfill. He is our uh, the, uh, code enforcement officer out there. Uh, he says that there's going to be a hazardous a ha household hazardous waste event coming up hazardous household waste that would be paint chemicals anything like that that you got laying around the house you're not using them it's dangerous to leave them around the house like that take them get rid of them. some of them may be even combustible this is stuff you want to get rid of chemicals now all right this is coming up on june 3rd that's this saturday this saturday beginning at nine and going all the way to three o'clock so you can take your your Household hazardous waste, cleaning supplies, anything that's got any sort of petrochemicals in it. It's just a, a, a collection of chemicals around the household there. Out to the Wayne County Landfill from 9 till 3 this Saturday morning. Summer camp coming up for youngsters between the ages of 7 and 13. That will be coming up on June 12th next week. And it'll go all the way to August 18th. It's $20 per week per camper. And that's a 25 camper man maximum. Registration is taking a first come, first serve basis. It's going to be doing a whole bunch of stuff. That's the Goldsboro Parks and Recreation Department's uh, event. A petacular, petacular event coming up, the adoption event at the Wayne Animal Adoption and Education Center this Saturday. A petacular event. Uh, it's going to be a lot of things going on out there. Everything starts at, at 11 o'clock, goes till 3 in the afternoon. Uh, lots of things going on. They're going to be giving rabies shots for first year shots between 11 and 12. Those are $10. There's also going to be Eli and friends boarding and grooming and training will be there. The fire department will be there displaying stuff, fire stuff. Uh, fun games for everybody. It'll be a dog kissing booth, if you can believe that. A dog. That's what it says. Huh? Okay. The sheriff's canine units will be there anyway. A whole lot of fun. That's coming up this Saturday at the uh, Wayne County Animal Adoption and Education Center at 919-731-1439, 919-731-1439. In fact, there's a special on kittens right now, $10 will get you a new family member, a, a four-legged furry one. Yeah, kittens. Uh, okay, this Saturday, what else? Oh, trivia question. At any given hour, at any given hour, there's 61,000 Americans or 61,000 people at this place, at here, at this location, where is here? Well, this location will be the U.S., but you'll find 61,000 people in, an, in every hour, on average, flying above the U.S. in airplanes. Airline passengers, that's who they are. 61,000 of them every hour. 61,000 people at any given hour flying above the U.S. of A. All right, that's the answer to our trivia question for today. Let's do it again bright and early tomorrow morning. We'll be here at 7 a.m. And then the show repeats at noon, then it re-repeats at 5.30 p.m. So as we take one more look outside, you see the background there, the, the, uh, the water tower in the background. Yep, kind of, kind of cloudy skies out there. So take an umbrella with you because you just don't know. Drive carefully. Please wear your seatbelt. So until tomorrow, for Bria McCoy and for Pat Garner, I'm Wayne Alley, and this is Wayne Goldsboro Television.